being autistic i understand who i am but the actual question is do i need to understand or does society need to understand me I I am Rafan everyone is different and so am I autism cannot define me I define autism Hey everyone my name is Johan I'm Rafan's elder brother um so Rafan has something called as autism spectrum disorder also known as ASD um now this is a developmental condition uh which means that sometimes he doesn't understand social cues and he can't process a lot of information at a particular point of time um also occasionally it overstimulation is a bit of an issue for example if he's in a very loud noisy crowded place he won't feel very comfortable none of us will but most of us can bear up with the fact that it's loud noisy and crowded but for people with ASD they can't hide the fact that it's bothering them and so it's pretty obvious that they're uncomfortable uh one way that people with ASD try to cope with these situations is by stimming so what is stimming stimming is a sudden movement or a very repetitive movement that keeps that is constantly done by a person with ASD so that's stimming um normally people with ASD use fidget kits to reduce the stimming um overall it's not since Rifan is high functioning um in the autism spectrum disorder it doesn't affect his intelligence as much though occasionally he needs some help um however he doesn't understand social cues so for example if you joke around with him he might take stuff a bit seriously because he doesn't understand the concept of a joke he doesn't understand social cues in that sense um if you would have noticed the way he has conversations with people also seems a bit unusual because he does not understand these social settings that are placed by society um so yeah um the thing with people with autism spectrum disorder is that they just need time and patience and a bit of understanding growing up with rifan i didn't know much about autism spectrum disorder so um we wouldn't gel along very well we wouldn't be like the best of friends um but now that i've moved to australia i have learned more about what autism spectrum disorder is um learned about the condition and now i know and can relate everything that i found it as a kid with those things and um i just feel bad because sometimes i feel like if i knew about this earlier on i could have helped him out um now i'm like in a completely different country and can't help him out but yeah people with autism spectrum disorder are just like everyone else they just need a bit more patience understanding and caring